Hey guys, super stoked today. We got a call from the wastewater department that our septic permit is done. It's ready to be picked up. So we're gonna run down, we're gonna pick it up, we're gonna jump straight over uh, to, I guess it's the building, I don't know, we'll just say it's the building permit office and we will go ahead and do our application, get our build permit and um, all that. So yeah, let's get into this. All right, guys, we just got our build permit. Um, so I'm back here at the property where all the stakes are. We're trying to get the foundation guy out here today since I took the day off work to take care of the, the permits and stuff. So, um, but yeah, uh, they're not actually going to post the build permit on our board until the footers are dug. And once the footers are dug and the inspector comes out and inspects them, everything's good. Then he's going to post the build permit um, once that part's done. So, um, yeah, this is kind of where we're still at. Uh, it was $2,144.80 um, for the build permit, and then the adequate tax was. Three thousand dollars, so fifty-one forty-four eighty was the total cost for a build permit here in Wilson County, Tennessee. So, and then our driveway—I don't know if you can see it. Uh, where are we at? Our driveway here goes up, down. Um, that was twenty-two hundred dollars, and they used. Uh, I want to say some three three and under rock that didn't underlame it they put um like this black pad down you know well they dug it out put a black pad down poured the gravel all that and then here is the dirt pile right here where they basically took up for the driveway so uh it's getting there um i have to find over here where we're going to come into the garage right here i don't know if you can see it here oh, hold on. let me get my hand right okay here to there there somewhere or right there there it is no that's not it but anyway right here is the entrance to the garage on the side but the problem I have is that these rocks are kind of in my driveway. So I'm going to have to get somebody out here with a ram hoe or a breaker. Get all this mess right here broke up. Get it moved down. Um, because if not, then they're going to raise my foundation too high. Well, too high for my liking. Um... So I want to get these rocks taken out, kind of get that, get the driveway down so I can get the entrance to the garage down, keep everything as far as the foundation down. So yeah, hopefully we can get the foundation guys out here today and uh, get that rocking. But anyway, hey guys, thanks for watching again. Uh, like, subscribe helps a lot. And uh, I'll try to you guys post more and more updates and things get done around here. I know it's been a little slow these past, you know, month, you know, a few weeks. So, um, but now since we got the build permit, everything's going to take off. Um, I'll probably, I know I was saying I was probably going to post videos every, you know, every week, once a week. But I think what's gonna end up happening is it's gonna be more like every other day I'll be posting videos as the work and stuff starts to take off now I do plan on doing some of the work on the house myself um, I do plan on doing the cabinets myself trim work um, I'm not sure what else I plan on doing myself 
Uh, it's going to be hit or miss. I might do the flooring myself. Uh, I used to, actually used to be a flooring contractor. So I might go ahead and do that. But I found some guys that got a pretty good deal on sand and finish and all that. So I might just let them do it. But anyway, guys, this is where we're at. Thanks again. Like, make sure you subscribe. And see you guys next time. Get that fire, fire back in my bones Before my heart, heart turns into stone so Hey guys, <clears throat> I also wanted to show you the driveway that we just had put in last week. So, you can see it behind me here. And of course, here's... You see the flags for the house staking. But yeah. Super stoked. Let's go get this.